The Union Delta State, the Governor Sheriff Burwari, has approved the payment of the new minimum wage to state workers effective this month. Secretary to the State Government Dr. Kingsley Amo said this during a meeting with the leadership of the organized labor comprising the Nigeria Labor Congress NOC, Trade Union Congress TUC, and the Joint Negotiating Council JNC. The meeting was called by Governor Oborori to discuss the implementation of the new minimum wage. And His Excellencies has said, has directed that effective immediately we should start pay making payments from this October to announce to Commissioner for Finance, Head of Service, Accountant General, that effective immediately if this minimum wage is not reflected, the consequential adjustment is not reflected, you have yourself to blame. Because governor has directed explicitly that this must be done. And whilst the payment is being done, please take time out to revisit all the computations that we have done, just to make sure we're on the same page and we're able to present a common figure consistent with what the exposure should be and the consequential adjustments on our cash flow to enable us to do proper planning. On his part, the chairman of the Nigeria Labour Congress, Comrade Goodluck of Obruko, commended the governor for the prompt approval, adding that he had made the work of labour easier. Comes, what comes to the state, the staff strength and uh, the financial implications. And last week we met again. We had to adjourn because we said we must carry pensioners along because the circular also came that uh, there is a 32,000 addition to what uh, pensioners are supposed to get. So we have to go and work at the financial implications. And coming today to meet, and the governor said, go and implement and let it be uh, in the October salaries of workers in the state. We are very, very happy. We are grateful to the governor for putting smiles in our faces and we promise. It, it, it's, very, it's very, very correct and, and I appreciate uh, the governor for this kind gesture. If we all have been paying attention, he had actually green-lighted the uh, minimum wage from the one that was mentioned. And at a particular point in time, when the agreement was signed at the federal level, he actually directed the SSG, who was the, uh, who was the head of the team, to not take any other meeting apart from the one of the minimum wage. And it was labor who stonewalled the process in quotes because we wanted to have the template. And now that the template is out, it's a matching order for us. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.